Hi, I'm Kristen with Wildflowers and Fresh Food, and today I want to show you how to make the honey baked brie. This is Ina Garden's recipe. We all love Ina Garden, and she is just the master of simple, wonderful food. And so, in a lot of my cooking classes, we will make honey baked brie, which is simply taking a nice round piece of brie right from the from the from the store, and putting on three, four tablespoons of honey and placing it in the oven for about five to seven minutes to get hot and gooey. So my friends at Southern Farm Honey sent me a video recently and she asked if I've ever used her cinnamon pecan honey. Hey Kristen, my name is Jennifer Pettis. I'm with Southern Farms Honey and we are located in Spanish Fort, Alabama. Have you ever tried our cinnamon pecan honey on brie? and I had not and so we've been trying it and this is a new favorite it's a new twist and so again it's so super simple in the cooking classes that I do we do really simple recipes because we need to make it and make a whole meal and then have it all ready to eat and enjoy enjoy the meal so we do quick and easy and fun recipes so look at this gorgeous pecan cinnamon honey going over and Jennifer at Southern, Southern Farms Honey, she told me that she sometimes will bake her honey first and then add the topping. So you can really do this either way. I'm going to go ahead and put it on top first and then put it into the oven. So the amount is really up to you. A nice big generous amount because it's all going to um, heat up and goo a little bit. So you want to use an oven proof. Uh, dish before you plate it all and then you're going to put it all into the oven and then you're going to want to serve it on the same because it's very hard to transfer if you don't. All right so let's go ahead and put that in the oven. Okay so it's only been in the oven for about five minutes and to plate it I'm of course going to put on some crackers and I'm going to use a pretty plain cracker. This is just a water cracker and you know because this is gonna be really flavorful. You're gonna have your hot gooey brie and all that cinnamony pecan on top. So, but I do like some fresh fruit with it. So I've got some pear here. Let's do some pear slices. Fruit and brie is always a great combination. Put some of those there and then a pretty apple, a nice crisp apple is gonna be really good with that. You can do dried fruit, fig, anything you like. All right, so you're gonna wanna be careful your dish is gonna be hot. And if I were doing it, I would want a bite of apple on there too. I'm Kristen with Wildflowers and Fresh Food. This is the Honey Baked Brie. You can follow me on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. I've got a website. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel to keep in the loop and I'll keep the videos coming. Thanks for joining me today.